Hey guys, what's up? This is Lugia XG 2000 here. And here's another Benton review, but this time it's um, Alien Axe, I mean Alien Axe and his little creature thing. Well, um, I was, I got this thing out of Walmart. I did not see the regular figure, so I was like, um, looking for, uh, keep on looking for one. And then I found this guy. So it says, oh, well, this is not like the regular figure. Like, it comes, um, with the same figure, but just with something else. The reason why I wanted to get just the figure is because it came with that exclusive card and the Alien X, um, info card. Um, I did see some at Toys R Us later on after I got this, and I was disappointed, um, so I should have waited. But I was too anxious to get Alien X, so let's do a review. Okay. Let's get the Alien X off. Let's review this first. Let's get the rest of the last. Okay, this thing I don't really like. It looks cool though, but it has nothing to do with the show at all whatsoever. So yeah, just can move the tail around like that. These things can come off. You can like move them back and stuff. The legs can move. It's not that much to it. But then we have the Alien X um, figure. Now, Alien X is a rare figure, but now people have gotten it, but some people still do not have it. Um, I am looking for Grandpa Max, Gwen, Amdite, Regular Gwen, Soccer Ben, and Albedo, and I did not find them. Oh yeah, and also the new Cannibal. Cannon Cannonballs are really hard to find, and I can't find how to use it, so. Yeah, well, Alien X is kind of like translucent a little bit when you put them off to the light. Um, his arms can rotate 360. Um, his legs can just go back and forth. You can bend the knees. Yeah, his head goes 360 as well. Yeah, like that. And, um, for this guy, I would say he's a 10 out of 10. He's one of my favorites, um, as well. So, um, please stay tuned for more, um, Ben 10 Toys to Come. Okay? So, see you guys later. Bye.